Hey there, this is Wannabindi and today I'm going to show you a quick lesson how you can make a homing kunai or a projectile which is just tracking the nearest enemy and then it just shoots that little kunai and aligns the image angle properly so you can see how this actually works. So this is a little thing, maybe if you're a fan of Naruto or something like that, this is how you can copy that into your game. So let's get right into how we can do that. That is quite easy. I've built this little... Um, for what we need is just the create event and in our homing kunai which we're gonna build in some stuff. Just a few lines of code and then maybe you can do a collision but that is up to you. I'll just show you how the homing and how the image uh, well, angle adjustment works. And for the image itself I just use this little kunai here which is uh, very very pixely but it does the trick or I can use my killer mushroom but not today um so let's get right into our homing shuriken which I call it which is completely wrong <clears throat> it's the kunai so first of all we need to detect if well an enemy is there and you need to have this enemy but Let's assume you got some enemy or whatever object you are homing to and then you check is it there So we just go for instance exist and the next thing is all right So it does exist and then we just go for a function which is called instance nearest and that is just returning the nearest instance from this and X and Y position which is well from this little kunai here when we spawn it and then towards the Thing we want to uh, well check and that is of course again our object enemy and that we store in an uh, well in a variable which we call instance or enemy or whatever you want to call it and that we well manipulate in a few seconds and the next thing is we want to do something so we move towards the point and that is our place of our nearest enemy and that is just the instance x and instance y and that we do with a speed for I don't know let's say 4 it was now 5 then let's start with the 4 and for now this code has been triggered once it stores the nearest enemy and then it just goes to the direction of the nearest enemy but for now um, the kunai would be having all the time the same image angle that we want to change so we go image come on image angle not angle uh, well and now we can take the point direction function which i discussed in another video so if you don't know how this works i highly recommend you watch that one because point direction is super important and extremely great to use so we just go for our x and y and the comparing is to our instance x and instance y. So we just copy that stuff in, bam. And now we get our image angle here. And for example, if we for example have no enemy, we just go for a fallback and say, all right, instance destroy. Or we just go, I don't know, x plus plus, so it will just fly to the right. And well, once we start our game again, we do this we just press the button and here we go same stuff works pretty fine so for example if you have problem with aligning of the image and so on this is how you can do it hopefully that was entertaining for you i just wanted to give that out because i thought that is a cool thing to show and that was pretty much it come on hit it well that was it have a good one one up indeed